Hey, this is Teddy, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist. And the question I got to ask just now is how do I attach a um, Word document and a video file to a Google Sheet? And I'm going to show you your options in this video. But before I show you, do yourself a favor and hit that subscribe and notify button because I create these videos just for you. The question is all about how do I attach a, a Word document and a MP3 or video file to a Google Doc to a Google Sheet. So maybe you know here's let's go to a Google Sheet here. Here's one I've got right here. This is one I've been working with lately. Just to create some data, and I want to put you know a Word document in here, and I want to put a video file. So how do I do that? How do I embed them? Well, there's no insert for a, um, a video file. There's no insert for a, a Word document. So I can't just, ins I can insert an image, insert image into cells. Let me try that. Let me click on this cell and try insert an image in a cell. So let me go get the video, vi see if video will be translated as an image. Maybe it won't, maybe it will. So I'm gonna hit browse, I'm gonna go to download, and here's a video right here, and I'm gonna hit open. It's not supported, not supported. So I can't upload a image here. Now, a video as an image, so that's not gonna work. So here's another alternative, and I've tested this, I know it works. What you need to do, the, the best way that I've discovered to do it, is especially if you're going to share this with anybody else beyond your computer is to put the word document and the video file into your google drive then i can get the link to that google that that document that or that object that's in google drive and i can put the link in the google spreadsheet let me show you what i'm talking about so i'm going to go back to drive I'm gonna to go to my temp folder. Let me go to my temp folder, where's that? Here it is, temp. So I'm gonna get that video file and a Word document. I'm gonna put it in here. So what I gotta do is I have gotta hit new. I've gotta do file upload. Now, I'm in downloads. There's the video file right there. I think I can hit control and I can also go get a Google doc. Where is it? Uh, I'm in a Word document, there it is. And I got two of them. Let's see what happens if I hit both of those. It's doing an upload down in the right hand corner. The doc is up and the video is coming. Video is a short video, it shouldn't take too long. You can see right there is the resume document, and boom, there's the quick video. So there they are in my Google Drive in the temp folder, which means now I can share them. So if I click on this link, now I can, if I click on the object, there's two different ways of doing it. What I might want to do, again, if I'm going to share the sheet with someone else, I better make sure that others can see that document. So I have to go click on share. And then I said, you know, I change it from anyone, to, uh, any, change to anyone on the link. Anyone on the internet with the link can view this. So hit copy and hit done. Now let's go back to the spreadsheet. And here's the Word document. So I can put a hyperlink on there, which is I can click on this, this link right here or highlight that, just simply hit Command or Control K, paste the link and hit Apply. So now if I bring it over here and click on that and highlight it, you can see it's gonna show me the resume. And if I click on it, it's gonna open up the document for me to get to it. So that's the Word document that is in Google, my Google Drive. Now let's do the video. Same thing in the video. Let me go, go get the video. Here's the video right here. Let me make sure it's set for sharing. Click over here, anyone with the link, copy the link, hit done. Let me go back to the spreadsheet, do a Control K, Control V, hit apply. Now you can see again, similar to the Word document, if I hover over, it shows it to me. If I click on it, it opens up the, uh, the video in Google Drive. And by the way, somewhere in here, there it is right there, there's my download button that, that anybody who's viewing this could download it. 
So the simple answer that I've discovered is take the Word document, take the video file, put them in Google Drive, make them shareable to anyone the link can view them. Then come in here and you can, I could put the hyperlink if I want to uh, on the words. I can just put the, the URL if I want to. I can go over here and get this and, and same thing. I can hyperlink it to the text or I can go over here and get the URL and drop that in there. So I, I can show it, excuse me. So I can show the whole link if I want to in the Google Sheet. And furthermore, I've made those shareable so that anybody with the link can get to it so that if I make this shareable, so, uh, then anybody who can view this sheet can also view this Word doc and this video file. That is the best method I have discovered to be able to put a Word document and or a video file into a Google Sheet. By the way, if you're creating a Google Sheet so that just you can access it and that the Word document and video file are gonna be in links in there just for you to access it, then I don't need to make the document shareable. I can go back to that document and, and I hit the share button right here. Again, I, I can get rid of that and change it back to make it restricted, hit done, and then if I open up the video file, then I can just grab the link right there. And in my spreadsheet, I could put just that link. Again, the difference being this link right here is internal just for me to see. And this link is based on sharing for anyone outside of anyone beyond myself to see that file and assumably this shared spreadsheet. And we do the same thing for the Word document as well. If I only want to make it accessible for myself when I'm viewing my own Google Sheet. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. And I hope this is helpful for you.